two men and a woman had been killed in a collision between a vehicle and spectators at the Jim Clark rally in the Scottish borders, police have said. The incident occurred at about 1600 hours BST when a car taking part in the motor racing event came off the road. Another man was taken to Edinburgh Royal Infirmary where he is reported to be in a critical condition. An earlier collision at the event, at around 1400 hours BST, left five people injured, one of them seriously. In a statement, the organizers of the event, which was the 44th running of the Jim Clark rally, said they were devastated. Police Scotland said the rally had been cancelled with immediate effect after the second incident, which took place at Little Swinton, near Goldstream. It said investigations into both incidents were ongoing. Absolutely terrible. One eyewitness, Tony Cowan, told the BBC how the car lost control. It went sideways one way and then to the other side of the road and plowed into four people. It was terrible, absolutely terrible. I ran to help but there was little I could do. The air ambulance arrived after about three quarters of an hour. There were police cars and ambulances. It was chaos, just chaos, he said. Another eyewitness wrote on Facebook, Huge accident at rally. Not far from us. About 15 emergency vehicles here now and about 40 people stood working on the injured. Not good. Laura Bicker, BBC Scotland correspondent, said several witnesses had since contacted the BBC to say they were concerned about spectators standing in dangerous areas along the rally route. Clearly that is something the organisers will be looking at and something the police will be investigating as part of their inquiries, she said. Souped Phil O'Kane, from Police Scotland, said four men and one woman were injured in the first crash, which happened at 14.05 BST after a vehicle came off the road near Eccles. He said one man remained in intensive care at Edinburgh Royal Infirmary, while two men suffered fractures and were being treated at Borders General Hospital. The two other patients have been discharged. Soup Dokane said a second crash happened at 16.07 BST, adding the force was coordinating a multi-agency investigation into both incidents. I'd like to offer my condolences from Police Scotland, Scottish Borders Council and the organisers of the Jim Clark Rally for the tragic circumstances that bring us here, he said.